Good morning, class. Today we will read about the three little pigs and answer questions that go with the book. Miss Murray, can I use the boys' bathroom, please? Yes, but please hurry up. We're about to do a lesson on the three little pigs. I'm going to fake a school lockdown. Ha 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 ha. I'm hungry. Let's buy lunch at the cafeteria. The coast is clear. Let's rock and roll. Oh, my vocal cords hurt as I pull them. Well, anyways, what are we waiting for? Let's get on with this. Attention, 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 well, that was hilarious. I think the principal is coming back. Run for it. Um, little boy. Did you hear the announcement about gang members in the building? Come in my classroom to hide there. I'm sorry but all the desks are taken. You can hide behind the bookshelf while I hide under my desk. Attention, Attention all teachers, teachers, teachers staff, 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 students, students. We will we have this is this is this is this fake. There are no reason. We have 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 we Come out of the bookshelf. You are coming with me to the principal's office. Here he is, the one who created this lockdown. Okay. We need to have a serious talk with him. Do you know why you were brought to my office? Oh, never mind. We looked through security camera footage of you in my office faking this lockdown, saying that there were gang members on school grounds, and as a result, there were no gang members here. What are you thinking? Do you really want to be mostly involved with the rest? Do you really want to commit yourself of breaking the law? Young man, these drills are 100% serious. You're lucky that you are under 14 to get arrested. If you were in middle high school, or in college, you would have been on your way to jail by now. What do you have to say for yourself, young man? Look guys, I'm deeply sorry for all of this. This was only supposed to be a comedy-related prank. Comedy-related prank? Are you seriously trying to harm your own school your parents poured all their money into? This was official drama and terror for this school. That does it. I'm calling your parents, and you're suspended for 54 months. Oh no 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 oh 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 I'm so 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 sorry this will never ever 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 happen again. Shut your mouth. He's already dialing your mother's phone number. Hello is this Mrs. Glover? Okay, so your son went in my office three hours ago and faked a school lockdown. He said it was a prank, but it was terror and drama. Please pick him up. He's suspended for 54 months. Your mother is coming to pick you up. Are you angry with me? Angry doesn't begin to explain damage caused to the school. How freaking dare you get suspended for creating a fake lockdown? 
Did you know that can get you arrested? But mum it was only supposed to be a harmless, comedy related prank. Really? Harmless, and comedy related? Are you out of your freaking mind? You've terrorized and dramatized your whole school. They all thought there were gang members in school. When we get home we'll watch the news to see what the damage is now. Oh yes, you're standing. But mum. Stand. Today on Beyond News, a stupid Nick Jr. character exclaims a fake lockdown at a nearby school. Here we are live, at the terrorized school. Here we have the principal of this school. So principal, what do you have to say about this fake lockdown? So I went to buy lunch until I heard a voice on the intercom similar to mine. It was very dramatic until the lockdown was presumed fake. I am so mad at little Bill. He is now expelled instead of suspended. Thank you. Now we have 12 year old Judith who will now share her experience. Little Bill, whoever the heck you are, you have completely changed my life. My 8th grade brother is now in intensive care thanks to you. We are worried for him and we now give harsher punishments. Our family will never be the same. Goodbye. Thank you for sharing your experience little girl. Now we will interview another student. So I was in science class and all of a sudden this was an awkward moment. I knew it wasn't the principal because I saw him walking in the hallway. This put me in a huge panic. So do you think this was funny to you or anybody? No. This was not funny at all. Little Bill, you've terrorized the whole school. That's it. I'm so coming for you, Little Bill Cosby wannabe. Oh no please. Young boy we can talk this out. Wow. Sorry, but FOX News is having technical difficulties. Little Bill, you will be paying for all the damages you've caused. They will be mailed by tomorrow. I cannot believe we will have to pay all the bills and damages you created when you created this fake lockdown. Little Bill, I heard you made a fake lockdown. Oh, 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 oh. We are so mad at you right now. You are grounded, 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 grounded for 600 years. Now go to bed now and go to sleep. Also, when you're sleeping, I will take all the things you love away forever. Now go to bed now. What?